well around here as well. One person died yesterday in a Richland shooting that brought two others to the hospital. New information tonight, one of those people is in critical condition, and the other was booked in the Benton County Jail this morning for burglary. Police now say they've identified an additional two suspects involved in that shooting, and they're working to track them down. This is Richland's second homicide in the month of January so far. And not only that, but Cap KB's Riley Fitzgerald says these two incidents happened within just blocks of each other. She's been tracking both of these cases. The latest two homicides in Richland happened just a couple blocks from each other. Standing on the corner of Jadwin and McMurray, you can see the apartment complex where one homicide happened on New Year's Eve. And in the other direction, the neighborhood police are investigating the most recent homicide where one person was found dead in a Richland home. I think in the last 24 hours, people are kind of being very cautious, uh, especially uh, with a shooting just down the street. And, uh, yeah, I think, I think people are looking over their shoulders more and being very cautious, and I don't blame them. It's, uh, it's very unsettling. I talked to some people who live in the area. Coming up, they tell us how they're feeling living so close to the location of two recent killings in what was always a safe neighborhood. In Richland, Riley Fitzgerald, Caps KVU Local News.